Liam Mitchell might be good for now. It just doesn't. Well, it's your girl, Lisha the Man. Welcome back to my channel. So, as you guys see by the title, we are reacting to Love Island Season 10, Episode 1. Period. And like I told you guys in the last video, we will be reviewing every single episode this season. Okay, so if you like Love Island like I do, make sure you guys subscribe and like this video, okay? We better get straight into it. So, how do I feel about them meeting each other, the boys and the girls meeting each other before lining up and choosing? Because the public already chose for them, so I don't understand why they had to meet each other first and then the public and then got like blindsided that the public still gets you know it was kind of too little twist in the beginning so but i thought it was interesting though so that was good i noticed this from the jump so i'm not surprised at the end y'all but we're gonna start from the beginning that ella and andre and that's that's the whole thing when they had the couples meet each other first or the islanders meet each other first a few of them before bringing out the who the public chose for them i can tell that ella and andre was feeling each other you can tell they was flirting so I didn't know that they wasn't going to be able to choose each other either. So that was a surprise. And it seems like they was upset that they didn't get to choose each other, okay? So I think that might be a thing later on. I think they might revisit that situation, but not right now, okay? Crazy is George. I thought Jess was feeling George at the beginning because she looked like she was upset that he, how he responded with his answer like he wasn't sure if he was like happy right off the bat he kind of hesitated a little bit so i thought just liked him at first but apparently she feels the same way so i don't see that going anywhere clearly if you guys watch the whole episode obviously yeah i really wish i mean eventually it's love out anyway so eventually i know that they're gonna be able to steal each other but i just wish at the beginning they got to steal i don't know the new beginning just kind of threw me off it was a surprise but I don't know. I don't know if it was a good one or what. It was just a surprise, okay? I seen afterwards online right now that the public is already feeling Molly and Mitchell. And I like them too for each other. I think they're like cute and bubbly and giddy. And I see it. But I also see Jess was kind of feeling him. So I don't know how that whole situation is going to go. But obviously the new dude came in. So and Jess looks like she's feeling him. And I think the new dude is going to be feeling Jess. Period. Zachariah, yeah, but Ella and Tyreek, when they first met each other, and the whole little comment about I met you in London already, or we already met before, and the fact that he didn't remember her it was just like that would have been a note. But later on, you see, he said her hair was different. We'll see, okay. And speaking of Tyreek, I did not know that Catherine was feeling Tyreek. I didn't know that even Rucci was feeling Tyreek and Andre. I see Rucci and Medney. I don't see that going anywhere. I don't see the chemistry at all. Obviously, that's why she stepped up at the end because I just don't see it for them. Like he even admitted at the end too. He not feeling it. She's not feeling it. They're not feeling each other, okay? But I also think the new guy, Zachariah, will not go for Rucci either. I don't see it right now. I think that him and Jess will be something. I don't think that he'll go for Rucci, which I think will leave Rucci kind of vulnerable too. But she seems to have an eye on Tyreek and Andre. So, there might be something too. But Catherine has an eye on Andre and Tyreek as well. So, there might be a hole. Because I thought that Catherine, Tyreek, and Andre was going to be a triangle. But now that Ruchi likes both of them too, that could just be a whole little quadruple whatever. Okay? And yeah, y'all definitely, when Jess asked in the, the makeup room that anyone else likes or fancies George, I knew for a fact there too. I was like, okay, yeah, she definitely ain't much for George at all. And the fact that nobody even answered is even more crazier because I don't think nobody's really feeling George, which is sad. Okay? I think that's it, y'all. That sums up the first, to me... This was a quick little review. I, like I said, I see a whole little quadruple thing going on with Ruchi, Andre, Tyreek, and Catherine. I think Jess and the new guy will hit it off. So I think that Molly and Mitchell might be good for now. If Jess doesn't, because I do think she still kind of likes Mitchell. So yeah, and I'm hoping that Medi and, or Medi and Ruchi find somebody, because obviously they're not feeling each other. I don't know why I feel like this is less Islanders. I feel like I, I don't know why. I don't know why. I think it's how they threw them in. I think it's how the beginning was. It just feels a little different. I like it so far. It's okay. It's good for the first episode because at least the first episode I can already tell it's like 
not everyone is stuck on each other right away because that would be like not interesting but yeah it looks like it might be some drama we might see something go down so i'm excited for tomorrow night so you guys let me know in the comments what you guys think about the first episode who you think is feeling each other who you think is not feeling each other who you think might end up feeling each other or end up together and what you think the surprise would be because who is vulnerable would they bring somebody else in or would somebody be done from the villa or what so yeah i'm looking forward to tomorrow night for tomorrow night if you guys like this review, comment down below and let me know also what you guys think about the episode as well. Make sure you guys like this video, share this video, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so you're notified every time I post a brand new video. And bless my loves.